So I used to I used to use these um, these shoes that I would get from this place called Shoes for Crews. I'd use these for my uh, where I would work because uh, they um, back when I used to work in fast food they they have they have really good um, uh, anti slip. It's oil resistant soles they have. So they have a lot of shoes. The shoes for crews. They have a lot of shoes that are um, good for if you work in slippery places like restaurants where the floors are greasy. But anyway, so that's what these are. These are shoes for crew shoes, and they're man-made material on the upper part. But I'm I'm not sure about the bottom part. Um. So I had these for a long. I had I had these for a long time, and they got a hole there. Um, I think that was from when, like, there was a time when, at one factory I worked at, I had to wear a steel toe, um, steel toe shoe, boots, and it would wear out my sock, and it would wear, it would cut into my sock, and then it would cut into my toenail, so my toenail would get sharp. So I stopped wearing those, those, uh, those, um, steel toes for a while, and then my toenail was sharp, and it would cut into... Because it would my my uh, sock would already have a hole in it, so my toenail was sharp, and it would cut through the uh, the shoe. So that was irritating. But then I found these other these these uh, caps that you slip you slip um, it's kind of like a slipper, but it would have a like a composite uh, front part that would fit over your toe that would protect your your toes. Um, but that got annoying after a while too, because sometimes it would fall off. But that's why that's ho that hole there is from my. I had a toenail that was sharp from um, the stupid steel toes. And but then I had a, an issue with my bike where the chain uh, it was all messed up because there I guess there was too much gunk on it, and it would kept skipping, and uh, my my foot kept slipping off, and oh I got so mad. And then um, it got so bad where uh, my f my foot fell off and my my shoe got so badly damaged because I uh, it hit the the sidewalk and then it wore out another hole over here. That's from just the sidewalk. And see, this is when uh, the shoe was rubbing. It just kind of skidded on the sidewalk, and that hurt. I think I was bleeding somewhere from it too, and then it totally wrecked the shoe. So I can't. Well, I can wear them, but then they're. I I was wearing them for a while until I got a replacement shoe, but they were kind of flopping around, kind of a tripping hazard when I was going up and down stairs. So that was irritating. <sighs> so that uh, make sure your chain doesn't do that. If your chain starts jerking on you. Make sure to fix it so that you don't have your your shoes get wrecked like me. Because that was bad. You don't want to wreck your shoes. Oh yeah! My socks! I totally ripped a hole, like over here, I totally ripped a hole in one of my socks that I only... I, di I didn't even have it for that long, so I was, I was very angry about that. 